Then there were two, and wouldn't you know it, it's the top two finishers in the Nick 10 that are the final two state line boys soccer teams remaining in the postseason, and both made the trip to Wheaton for the St. Francis sectional Tuesday night. Boylan playing in game one of our doubleheader and Dota Jester screens because we got some blue turf for you. Fields aside, let's get into it. Under seven minutes left in the first half, scoreless until a Trojan is left unmarked, setting up for the goal there, one nothing. Timothy trying to pull off the upset against the Titans. Tr Titans, Trojans, good alliteration there. But the Titans come out of the halftime, come out of halftime with some aggression. After t uh, Timothy defender falls on thin air, Reese Schlichting is left open and he has himself the equalizer with just over 33 minutes to go. Then Timothy goes for the lead with this absolute rocket of a shot. But Patricio Lopez with a tremendous stop there keeps it even for the Titans and Trojans. Then with under six minutes to go on a fall evening, 1-1 still until Timothy sends it straight up and into the back of the net for the go-ahead goal as all Boylan can do is watch and that would be the end of things as Boylan's season comes to a close in the round of 32. To the other half of our doubleheader now, Belvedere North taking on top seed Bennett Academy, 15 minutes 15th minute of the first half here, a scoreless game until Bennett comes on the attack and they deliver the first blow of the game to make it a 1-0 game. And before we reached halftime, the Red Wings would wind, would find the back of the net once again on the follow-up after the attacker is left unmarked. Red Wings move on, but the future looks bright for North as the team only loses two seniors heading into 2024.